Hello? Hi. We can't see your face, honey. Are you ready? Okay. All right, get your phone together. Hello. Okay. What's your name, baby? Courtney. Oh, your, your system sounds crazy. What's your name? Courtney. Courtney. Courtney, how old are you and where are you calling me from? I'm 30. I'm calling you from Scotland. England. You're from England. And how old are you? I'm 30. 30. Courtney watching us in England right now. Pardon? You're in England? Yes. Okay. Courtney, England, 30. Do you have any kids? Yeah, I've got one. Hello, how's your child? She's 10. Okay. Have you ever been married? No. What do you do for a living? I'm not working at the moment. You're not working at the moment? How do you pay your bills? I'm not working because I had an injury on my life. Oh, uh, so you get disability? Uh, not really, no. How do you pay your bills? Uh, somebody pays my bills for me. Is it a man? Yes. Are you sleeping with him? No. Then why is he, so he's a friend? It's my baby's father. Your child's father, okay. We're getting somewhere. So is he, is it child support or he just paying your rent? Um, he does everything. He does everything. How long has he been doing everything for? For the past 10 years. Huh? Past 10 years. Oh, so he's always paid all your bills. Yeah. When was the last time you had sex with him? Yes, sir. He is took his question. Is this him right here? Who has had this question? That's my friend. Is that your child's father? Listen, it's personal thing. Why you ask her this question? Because she has what to ask her. Yeah. Her. It's your personal issue. Why she asked you this question? She is speaking to change is okay, but not uh, doesn't matter your personal issue. What is that? Why you ask her your her because, personal question? Because I host a dating show, and when someone says that they don't have a job, we ask them, how do they pay their bills? That's why I asked the question. Because yeah, I know. looking for a new man to date. So I think it's good information for a man to know how she get her bills paid every month. Yeah. And okay, you, go ahead. You got anything else to say? Go ahead. Yeah, mind your business. Now, do you want to find someone else new? Yeah. Well, you're looking for a man, correct? Yes. Okay. So, with that being said, you know a man may be concerned that your child's father is your sole provider. Well, he has to be. Okay, he has to be. So, when you get with a new man, will he still be your sole provider? Um. I think for yeah for his child. For his child. Okay. Um like, I mean you don't have to answer, but I think I think it's important for this dynamic. When's the last time you slept with your child's father? Yes, ago. Oh, okay. So it's just he's just taking care of you because you take care of his child. Yes. Okay. All right. So we got Courtney England, 30, one child that's 10. She's currently not working. What's your zodiac sign? I'm a Pisces. Pisces. All right, but what kind of man are you looking for? Um, I'm not looking for someone to provide for me because I already have that. Girlfriend, what kind of man you think is going to be okay with your baby daddy being your provider and then now he's going to date you? What kind of man? He's Kyle, he's providing for Right, but you don't think that a serious man, not a man who just wants to sleep with you and don't really want to build a life with you and is not taking you as a serious option, 
You don't think a man that would want to take you as a serious option would have a problem that your baby daddy is your sole provider as he makes you his woman? He said that was a stupid question. He said, what happened? What happened? He said it's a stupid question. It's a stupid question that you just told me you don't need a provider because you already have that. So for a man that is entering your life, you are letting him know you don't got to worry about taking care of me because my baby huh? daddy takes care of me, but I still want you to treat me like a queen uh, and a wife you don't think she? that a man that was taking that would take you serious would have an issue okay. with that um i don't think i'm so. not talking about a, hold on, and i want to be clear i'm not talking about a man who just wants to sleep with you or not taking you serious a woman that um that man is taking care of the child well you didn't say taking of the child you said taking care of you there's a difference i think everybody will understand but hold on everybody i want to get this clear taking care of his child makes sense right like we agree that he should take care of his child financially and help out but what you said he also provides for you completely too you don't work so as a new guy is dating you your baby daddy is where you get your money from you don't think you'll have a problem with that um, I don't think so. Okay, so oh, let's keep it going. She don't need a provider. She already has that. What else you want, Courtney? Um, listen, sir, we can't see your face. So do you want to come on camera? And say what you gotta say, cause I'm not gonna. No. Keep... Okay. Well, listen, I'm hosting a live show. If you want to talk to your friend, we can go. But right now, I'm asking you questions. So, is there anything else you want in your man before we go to the next question? But, but I'm not asking for much. Like I'm just asking for the bare minimum. What is the bare minimum again? Is uh, um, I don't want you to provide for me. Okay. Um, I, I don't want you to give me a house because I've already got one. Say what happened? I've already got a house. You already got a house? Yeah. Okay. What are your not? What, what are your deal breakers? We call it deal breakers. What are your deal breakers? My deal breakers is um. Short men. Short men. Yeah. Because I'm already tiny. Okay, so somebody taller than you. Yeah. Okay. Just out of curiosity, if you want to go out with your friends and get your hair done, where do you get the money from? Your child's father? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So if you want to, so if your if your boyfriend want to take you out on a date and you had to go shopping for clothes, you would get the money from your baby daddy to go out with your boyfriend. No, oh, my boyfriend has to pay for it. Oh, okay. So in that case, if you want to go out with your boyfriend, the boyfriend would give you the money. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We're getting somewhere. All right. So oh. did, your did your boyfriend make a certain amount of money? Oh, I would say, yeah. Okay, what is the minimum amount of money he needs to make? Like maybe 50K pounds. Do you know what that is in American money? Uh, I'm not sure. I think it's like um, 80K. Fifty pounds in American cash. Let's see if I um fifty 
Oh, actually, it's sixty-two, sixty-four thousand in American money. Yeah. Okay. Let's do the Kendra Cam, Courtney. Okay. Okay. You are small. Yeah. Okay. Let's see you, Mama. Okay. So we got Courtney. Do you want the guy to be in England? Fix the camera. He said up, yeah. Okay, fix the camera back to the way it was. Bring the camera back to the way it was, the phone. Okay, prefer a man in England. What's the age range you want to date? You're 30? Uh, maybe, oh, uh, 29 to 40. 29 to 40. All right, when was your last relationship? Maybe three years ago. Three years ago. You don't have to answer, but I'm going to ask. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? Um, three months ago. Okay. Three flaws you have to work on. Um, three flaws. Oh <laughs> this is a hard question. Um, I would say maybe. I don't know. Actually. You don't. You don't know three things you have to work on. Yeah, I don't. Why not? Because nobody's ever told me that I have to work on something. How long you been out of work for? Pardon? How long have you been out of work for? For six weeks. Oh, six weeks. Oh, so six weeks ago you worked. Yeah. Do you plan on going back to work or no? I do, but I have a. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know what he is. What did he say? I have a. a um, I wish I could show you, but I have a bandage on my leg. Get your bandage. Get your a bandage on your leg. A lot of people feel like your friend kidnapped you. I don't think that's true. They feel like the guy that's with you right now. I don't think that's true, cousin. No, that's not true. Yeah. I don't think that's true. All right, um, but you don't. You can't. You can't name. You can't name one thing that you have to work on to become a better partner. Um, become a better partner. No, I feel like I'm. I'm a good partner. What if, uh, Ucha, why would a guy be lucky to be with you? Because I'm nice, I'm sweet, I'm very friendly, um, very kind. Um, Okay, Courtney, honey, are you on the Kendra G Singles dating app? Not yet. Okay, download the app. I'm quite sure Courtney is taken. What would you like your name to be on the app? Um, maybe I'll choose like um, Courtney Moyle. Courtney, what? Say it so they can know how to find you, honey. K O U. Don't cover your R mouth. Love. You have to be able to hear you. K O U R T N E Y and then M O Y O. Um, do you have a favorite number? Oh, I'll put zero three. Three? Zero three. Zero three. So make your first name Courtney zero three. That'll be the easy way for the people to find you, okay? Spell it again. K O U. P N E Y. There's no R, and then R, R in it? You don't have an R in your name? I do. I said K O U N T K O U R N T Y. K O U R T N E Y. Zero three. Okay? Mm -hmm. All right, honey. Download the app. Set up your profile. Bye, sweetheart.
coming for me, Jesus. Kendra G Singles, the dating app is available now on your iPhone and your Android phones. Just go to your Apple Store or your Google Play Store and download it now. Kendra G Singles, the dating app.